What is the purpose of your life? I hear that. Glorify God. Where does it say that? Is there a Bible verse that says, here's, here's, what, here's why you exist? Glorify God. What is the purpose? I mean, is life just a glorified Monopoly game? Get a whole bunch of stuff now because when the game is over, it's all going to go back in the box? Is that what life's about? If it is, we're wasting our time here tonight because I'm not going to tell you how to get more stuff. Okay? We're not going to be talking about stuff here. But this is what's taught in our culture, right? Life is a glorified Monopoly game, is it? Is the purpose of your life just to become a believer? No. What is the purpose of your life? Manifest the glory of God. Where does it say that? Yes, sir. Well, that's part of it. Be fruitful and multiply. We're supposed to do that. Make disciples. Know God. I think the purpose of life is actually found in the Harvard University Charter. Harvard University? Yeah, 1636, the Harvard University Charter. Remember, it was started as a Christian school. It said, the purpose of this institution, I'm paraphrasing, the purpose of this institution is to teach young men, it's just a man's school at the time, to know Jesus Christ, God the Father, and eternal life. John 17, 3. The purpose of life is to know God and to make him known. And everybody in here can do that in a different way. Everybody can make God known in a different way because everyone in here has different gifts. That's why we have a body, because you can do things I can't do. I may be able to do things you can't do. We all come together as a body to do that. Our job, however, is not just to make believers. It is to reform not only other people in doing so, but also the culture. They go together. Evangelism, discipleship, and reforming the culture all go together. You want to reform the culture? Reform the person. But by also reforming the culture, you'll also improve your opportunity to reform the person as well. They're symbi symbiotic. They go together. We're supposed to be involved. No matter what you do, you're supposed to be doing all your work for Christ. Christ.